In the depths of the distant universe, there is a planet called Hope. There are all kinds of creatures living on this planet. They have different colors, shapes, and cultures, but they all have a common dream to create a better future. The residents of Hope are always proud of unity and cooperation. They know that only by helping each other and working together can they overcome difficulties and meet challenges. There is a brilliant cooperation tower in the center of the planet, which is a symbol of unity among the residents of Hope. Whenever they encounter difficulties, they will gather here to discuss solutions together. One day, the interstellar communicator issued an urgent alarm, and a strange-looking spaceship flew in the sky. The pilot of the spacecraft is an alien from a distant galaxy named Zeno. He has a sad face and a hint of anxiety in his eyes. Please help me, Zeno said anxiously. My planet, called Disaster Star, is facing an unprecedented crisis. Our resources are exhausted, the ecosystem has collapsed, and the residents live in fear. After hearing this, the residents of Hope immediately gathered around Zeno. Millie, a kind little girl, stepped forward and said, We will help you, but we need to know the situation of the disaster planet. Zeno told the story of the disaster planet in detail. It turned out that the residents of the disaster planet overexploited resources in pursuit of short-term interests, resulting in ecological imbalance and eventually falling into trouble. We must save the disaster planet, Millie said firmly. Residents of Hope Planet, can we unite as one to help Zeno's planet? Of course, the other residents responded in unison. They realized that the plight of the disaster planet was not only related to Zeno's planet, but also closely related to the future of the entire universe. So Millie and the residents of Hope Planet began to prepare. They designed a detailed plan to go to the disaster planet to help the residents rebuild the ecosystem and restore resources. A week later, the residents boarded the spacecraft, carrying various plant seeds and ecological restoration tools, and headed for the disaster planet. The spacecraft traveled through countless interstellar spaces and finally arrived at the once beautiful but now devastated planet. Welcome to the disaster planet, Zeno said excitedly. Thank you for coming. When Millie and her friends first set foot on the land of the disaster planet, they saw the desolation and ruin around them, and they couldn't help feeling heavy in their hearts. The soil here is dry and cracked. There are few trees, and the air is filled with a suffocating smell. We must act immediately, Millie said loudly and everyone nodded in agreement. The residents of Hope Star quickly divided into several groups and began to work intensively and orderly. Millie led a group of people to the wasteland and began to plant saplings, while other residents cleaned up garbage by the river and restored water sources. As time went by, the bright sunshine sprinkled on the earth. The saplings gradually took root and the water in the river became clear and sweet. Zeno and the residents of the disaster planet saw the dawn of hope and joined the ranks of environmental protection. Everyone worked together and made joint efforts. However, the road to rebuilding the ecology is not smooth. One day, a strong storm came and uprooted the saplings, and the cleaned river was blocked by debris again. The residents of Hope were frustrated, and some even began to doubt. Can we really change the fate of Disaster Star? Millie felt the loss of her friends and couldn't help worrying. She decided to gather everyone, stand on the top of the cooperation tower, and tell everyone her ideas. Dear friends, difficulties are only temporary. We can't give up. The power of Hope Star lies in unity and cooperation. We must continue to work hard. Every small action of ours will gather into a force for change. Inspired by Millie, everyone regained confidence and started working again. Zeno 
also actively participated and organized training for the residents of Disaster Star to let them learn how to protect the environment and manage resources. After several months of joint efforts, the face of Disaster Star gradually took on a new look. The blue sky smiled again. Green trees and flowers dotted the earth and the river became clear. In the end, with the help of Millie and the residents of Hope Star, the residents of Disaster Star successfully rebuilt the ecosystem and restored resources. They cheered excitedly and gathered together to celebrate this great victory. Thank you, dear friends, Sino said with emotion. It is your unity and wisdom that saved the Disaster Star. We will always remember this deep friendship. Millie and the residents of Hope Star smiled and said, This is just the beginning. In the future, we will work together to create a better interstellar home. Under the guidance of the spirit of interstellar cooperation, the residents of Hope Star and Disaster Star joined hands to establish an interstellar environmental protection alliance in order to continue to face various challenges in the universe together. They understand that only cooperation and unity can create a better future. In this galaxy, the friendship between Millie and Sino bloomed under the starry sky and became a legend, inspiring the residents of countless planets to join hands and jointly protect the vast universe. <laughs>